Hey guys, welcome back to another Duelist Destiny box opening. And you guessed it, today we're going to open up the new Dragons and Legend Complete series from Konami. This set is going to be totally epic. Let's take a look at the product. So in this product, we're looking for the new Dark Magician Girl Dragon Knight in the alternative art. And on the box, that is what the alternative art is going to look like, guys. So if you can imagine what the original artwork looks like, this is pretty epic. And in this, we're going to be looking for uh, two uh, complete series packs. There's 18 cards each. They're like the mega packs from the tins. Uh, less fewer cards. I think the tins had 24 cards each. Uh, one of seven secret variants, which is just like Legendary Duel Season One. And then the one thing they did differently is they actually threw in some dice guys. So that's pretty cool. And supposedly they're really nice. And then if we take a look a little closer, we're actually going to get a couple really interesting cards in here. So these are the variants. So we're going to get Hundred Dragon, Time Wizard of Tomorrow and Jinzo layered. So again, if you don't know, Jinzo was from Pharaoh's Servant is the original card. So now we've got the Jinzo layered XZ's card, which is pretty cool. All right, guys, are you ready? Let's get into it. So I'm hoping that we get the Dark Magician Girl Dragonite. Don't know, I'm not expecting it. We are gonna also, just so you guys, if you can see them in the background here, we are gonna open a couple tins because I'm still looking for the Dragoon. It was kind of depressing. I opened, uh, me and the wife opened seven tins total and didn't get it, no Dragoon. All right, so guys, here's the dice. So these are supposedly actually pretty cool. If I can open it, holy moly. There we go, all right. So if you can see like the size of them, they're actually pretty big. They're not a standard size die. And then they have, uh, that looks like the uh, Tamias dragon there. So pretty cool. So this is the, uh, it's more like a turquoise and we've got the official uh, Yu-Gi-Oh logo going on there. So that's pretty cool. And I love how they did the six, actually. That's very unique. I think we'll actually use those. So we're gonna set our pretty dice over there. All right. So these do come with promos, unlike the tens this year. And so we actually have Awakening of the Possessed, uh, Razen Ryu. So we're gonna set our promo back over here. And let's get into our first pack. So and they are continuing doing the different pack art, which is pretty cool. Let's see what we can get. All right, so we've got Perfect Marple Corn, <laughs> Aquarium Lighting, number 78 number archive. And I think we're expecting, I think there's gonna be two or three ultras in here. One secret, Black Cat, Aqua Story, Shadow Tune. That is very cool. So there are gonna be a lot of tunes in here again. Doom Virus Dragon. So I think that was a uh, Duelist Pack Kaiba or Legendary Kaiba Collection card at one point. So in a green. Ultra rare, that is very slick. So we're gonna kind of set that over there. And there is our Dark Magician Girl, the Dragon Knight, uh, in the regular art. Very cool. I actually didn't have this card yet, so that's very slick. So not the alternative art, but I will take it. I will take it any day. Cyber Angel, I Dayton, Flash Fusion, Flower Cardian, Aqua, Red Eyes Burn, very cool card and Goddess Bow, very cool, Warrior. So already guys, I'm actually pretty happy with that so far because I wasn't expecting to get Dark Magician Girl uh, Dragonite on the first, first pack. I'll take the regular art any day. All right, so here we've got the alternative art. Can we pull the alternative art version in our first box? And I know we only got two box openings, guys. Uh, we are having uh, a little bit of troubles getting product uh, early and our stores are actually sold out. Uh, Time Magic Hammer, that's a very cool card. Dark Dragon Ritual, very cool. Rising Sun Slash, Cyber Angel Batoon. Tamias, the Knight of Destiny, very cool. Ultra rare card there. Claw of Hermos, and the blue colorful rarity. And <laughs> uh, Tamias, the Knight of Destiny again, in the uh, blue rarity as well. Uh, Relay Soul. Number 51, Aquarium Stage, Double Magical Armbind, Performable Uni, 
So very cool. All right, so that's our first mini box, guys. So we're gonna switch over. And real quick though, if we go back, and so this is kind of what you can expect from one pack. So again, got our lovely Dark Magician Girl Dragon Knight, and then awesome Shadow Tune. Love it, love it, love it. So we're gonna set these aside over here. Let's kind of get our Dark Magician Girl Dragon Knight out on top there. She's very beautiful. We'll set our promo over here. So guys, we're gonna get into the tins next. I'm gonna go through the tins pretty quickly because we've got other videos. We've opened three each, uh, my wife and I. So we're gonna look for the um, Dragoon. So like I said, uh, we've opened seven tins total and kind of depressing that we didn't get uh, Dragoon. Now one difference in the tins this year, like we said, is there was no promo pack. Uh, which is kind of depressing. And another interesting fact is the European versions, I think it was, or Canada have completely different uh, pack art. I actually like, uh, they did like a plain gold uh, pack art, if I remember right. So we've got World Legacy, uh, Guard Dragon, Tinu Spirit, Subterror Succession, Gladiator Beast Charge, Salamangre, Fantastical Dragon Phantasme. That's actually a valuable card. I believe it's also a competitive card. So I'm very happy to actually get that. And then we've got Evil Eye. And then Mystic Mine. Actually, that's a very good card to get in the tin, guys. That's a very competitive card, I think. I don't think this was hit by the recent Konami ban list. I'd have to double check that. But Mystic Mine is a very good card to get. And Witchcrafter, I, I'm actually gonna do a Witchcrafter deck at some point, so Witchcrafter Pottery. I'm very happy to see that. Evil Eye Awakening. And then we've got the rest of the commons here. All right, guys, that was a pretty cool pack. Again, uh, if you get Mystic Mine, that's a pretty good pull from the tins. Pretty good pull. So we're gonna set that over there. We're gonna get into the uh, second mega pack. I'm actually reaching for the, <laughs> the second tin over there. We're not ready for the second tin yet, guys. So again, looking for the Dragoon. So we've got Trickstar, Fusion, Infinite Track, Rocket Synchron, Dark Factory, Dino Wrestler, Gladiator Beast, Beat Raptor, so we're gonna see some dinosaur cards in here. Wailing of the Unchained Souls. Draco Masters of Tinny for our secret Nomo material. Infinite Track Harvester, so no Dragoon in that pack either, guys. All right, but I've not lost hope yet, guys. We're still got some, I believe, in the heart of the cards, I believe. So going to this next pack here, Third pack, can we do it? Hyper Psychic, Abdominal, Extra Hero, Tinu Spirit, Marin SC Angel, Apple of Enlightenment, Sinet Mining, pretty cool card. Test Panther, and it's a Synchro Cybers Quantum Dragon, very cool. Marinus Marbled Rock, and Medusa Watcher of the Evil Eye. Evil Eye card, Madolce cards, Salamangrate, Fusion Fire, Vessel for Dragon Cycle. All right, guys, that was tin number one. Let's get straight into tin number two. Kind of speed through this so we can <laughs> catastrophic failure with our tin there. We're gonna get to tin number two pretty quickly so we can get back to the Dragons of Legend Complete Series. So we've got the Dino Wrestler, right? Ranyu, Rising Fire, Salaman Great, Marinus Snow, Guard Dragon Shield, Infinite Track, Trencher, Firewall Exceed Dragon, uh, Gizmek Yada, Gleaming Vanguard for a secret, Infinite Track for, and no Dragoon. Successor Soul, so that's actually another card we were looking for. This is the dark, uh, one of the Dark Magician Blue Eyes support cards that's new in the set. That's awesome. Uh, Marinus Wave, Infinite Track, Tyrant Dino. All right, two more packs. Looking for Dragoon. This will be 10 number nine total for the channel with no Dragoon. Nine tens, guys. Think about that. Nine, think about that for a second. Nine tens. So like Battles Legend, we did eight booster boxes looking for the 10,000 dragon. This is nine tens without a dragon so far, guys. 
And I feel a little jealous because some people have been buying like one tin at Walmart and pulling Dragoon like on the first try. So let's take a look and see if we can get our awesome Dragoon for Legacy, Abdominal, Dino Wrestler, Chaos Betrayer, Fury of Fire, Dances with Beasts, Mariness Blue Slug, Witchcrafter Edel, Prismatic Secret Rare. I'm loving these Witchcrafter cards. Link Monster, Appaloosa, Bow of the Goddess. I think that's one of the valuable cards, possibly. And nope, no Dragoon. Infinite Track, Anchor, Drill, Witch Howling, Guard Dragon, Dino Wrestler, Defender of the Labyrinth. No Dragoon. All right, guys, we only have one pack left. Now, if we don't get Dragoon in this pack, then it's gonna have to be up to my wife in her two remaining tins. Subterra Secession, Galactic Spiral Dragon, Rocket Synchron, World Legacy, Dino Wrestler, Pendulum Halt, Witchcrafter Scroll, Guard Dragon, Pisty. I actually can't read the title on that because it's too many characters. No Dragoon, Evil Eye Selene. Wow, nine tens and no Dragoon. All right, so it's up to my wife. So we'll see what she pulls in her opening video. She's gonna open the same content. But guys, are you ready for the second box of the Drags Legend Complete series? Let's go. All right, box number two. We were gonna order more of these, but we ordered a bunch of other stuff for you guys instead. So again, there's our uh, second die, uh, another green one. We'll just set that over there. Um, for the promo this time, we have Cyber Slash Harpy Lady. That's a pretty cool card. So we'll set our promo over there. Let's start with the Dark Magician artwork. Dark Magician Girl artwork. So we've got Machine Angel Ritual. Angel, Soul Charge, Flower, Rising Sun Slash, Black Cat, Dark Dragon Ritual, Toon Kingdom, there we go, that's a valuable card. So uh, I think Toon Kingdom right now for release price is about like a $20, $25 card, I think. Um, it does come in the other alternative arts, but uh, I don't think Toon Kingdom came in either Legendary Duel Season 1 or uh, Toon Chaos, I don't think. So let's finish our pack and see what other awesome uh, pulls we can get here. So we're gonna set Tomb Kingdom over there. Black Sonic, Paladin of Dark Dragon. That's a very cool card in the blue. I love the blue on blue. That is very cool. Raid Raptor, Blackwing Revenge, Red Nova, Cyber Angel, Goddess Bow, Aquarium Set, Performorple, Uni. All right, last pack, guys. Can we pull Dark Magician Girl? The Dragon Knight in her alternative art form. I'd be, I'm pretty happy so far with this uh, opening though. We've got Toon Kingdom and a couple other cool cards. So I can't really complain with that. Uh, number 100 Numeron Dragon, that's actually pretty cool. Doom Virus Dragon again, I think also in the green is what we already had. Shadow Tune, another one. Odd Eyes Mirage Dragon. So where actually was Doom Dragon or actual, which one was our Prismatic in that pack? Did we, did we not get a Prismatic in that pack? Well, other than the promo, maybe not. Maybe, all, maybe the promo is the Prismatic. I might be mixing up the tins, guys. All right. All right, so let's take a look over here at all of our Epic Pools. So again, we've got Dark Magician Girl. We did get one. The Dragon Knight, we're gonna set her off to the side there. Claw of Hermos, Tamias, the Knight of Destiny. Two of those, Doom Virus, Shadow Tune. I'm gonna kind of set these tune cards over here. And then let's take a look at all these other fantastical Dragon Phantasme, another epic card. Black Sonic, Paladin of Dark Dragon. So I'm just kind of pulling out my favorites. At this point, we got Shadow Tune in the green rarity, Doom Virus Dragon Tune Kingdom. Uh, we did not get an Eye of Tamias card. Uh, we did get some cool Witchcrafter cards though. So Witchcrafter Edel was pretty cool. Successor Soul was pretty cool. Infinite Track, uh, Watcher of Evil Eye, Marinces, 
Cynet Mining, and then eventually in here, we actually have our Mystic Mine, which I think was one of the earlier uh, Witchcrafter Pottery, very cool card, and Mystic Mine. Some very beautiful cards. So out of too many boxes, guys, that's kind of what you can uh, expect as pull ratios. You might pull uh, Dark Magician Girl, the Dragon Knight a few times. So the alternate version uh, for the artwork is actually gonna be a little harder to pull. So you might have to buy a case. Uh, I don't know of maybe even two cases. And as you can see, 10 number nine for Dragoon and we did not get it. So I don't know how people are pulling Dragoon. We bought tens from Walmart, from Target. We bought them from Simply Unlucky actually. We bought them on TCG Player and I just, it, it does not want to come to me guys. But if you like the content and you think this is totally epic, drop us a like on this video. It helps us a lot. We love you for it. Definitely subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to hit that notification bell because you'll get notified of all of our content that's coming out. And guys, thank you. Hope you love this. We'll see you next time.